Good morning. Welcome to Italy. And welcome to the mountains. We're at the foot of the Stelvio Pass and it's my job to ride this bike up the 24 kilometers and the 48 hairpins to the top. This is a Simplon Pavo Gran Fondo. It's a bike that we've recently tested on Road CC. We really like. It's got lightweight and comfort for the going up and it's got low gears. And it's got disc brakes for the going down. Um, it's about 2,750 meters at the top of the Stelvio. It's the second highest paved pass in Europe and it's quite cold up there. It's nice and warm down here, but it's about three degrees at the top and it might be snowing, it was earlier. But until we get up there, we won't know. So it's time for me to go and see how I get on with the climb. Let's go. Okay, we're at turn 29, which means there's 29 more hairpins to go on this climb. We're just above 2,000 metres now, which I think is about the highest I've ever been on a bike under my own steam. Even so, we're still 700 metres from the top. It's amazing the road through this forest. It's, it's crazy that they can build it here, but you can never really tell where it's going. I know in a minute it's going to open out into that famous vista of all the hairpins stacked up against the side of the valley. But for now, it's kind of weaving in and out of the trees. It's beautiful. We're kind of approaching the snow line now and um, we're going to leave the trees probably in about another few K. Okay, so we've reached the business end of the climb now, about five kilometers to go, and I can see all the hairpins stacked up in front of me, all the way up the valley wall. I'm starting to feel the altitude now, we're over 2,300 meters up, and I'm starting to get a little bit dizzy each time I put in a bit of an effort. So I'm gonna sit back down again, take it easy, spin up these last 15 hairpins, See if I can get to the top for a cup of coffee. Okay, so we've made it back to the car. We've just about beaten the light. We didn't quite beat the thunderstorm. Um, so what have we learned about the Stelvio? Well, it's a long way to the top. From where we are here in Salandro, it's two vertical kilometers up and 24 kilometers of the proper climb. But it's not that difficult. It's a grind, but it isn't steep. And if I can do it, then you can do it too. And I suggest you do, because it is a fantastic climb. The views are amazing. The road is amazing and the descent through the 48 hairpins is just as good. So give it a go. The Simplon has been brilliant on the way down. It was really composed in the hairpins. You never felt like you were losing grip on the corners. Fantastic. So thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more like this. There is a link to the review of this Simplon Pavo Gran Fondo in the description below. And if you have any questions about the climb, how we did it, what we thought of it, Ask them in the comments. See you soon.